Before Robux, there was Tix, which was a free method of money. Well, it's gone now. Today, I'm going to cover why Tix was removed from Roblox. Welcome back to Bloxflow. Let's get into the video. What was Tix? About four to five years from now, Roblox had a currency system in place, which included Tix and Robux. Now, all current active Roblox users are aware of what Robux is. It is Roblox currency that can be bought for real money and used to buy items in the game. On the other hand, Tix was a lot like Robux, but they actually were reward points that you receive for logging into Roblox every day. So when you log in on the Roblox every day, you are given a certain amount of ticks for it. It was practically free money that you could earn by just logging in once. Users could also earn ticks if they invited friends to play with them in their games. A set number of ticks were awarded for every player and a different amount for Builders Club games. These ticks were capable of being used like you use Robux today. You could collect a good amount of them and then go ahead and spend that on items in the catalog. Surprisingly, Roblox decided to remove this feature from their platform and just limit the currency to Robux in April 2016. Moreover, to celebrate ticks and help you just get rid of their existing ticks, Roblox hosted an event called the Tixapalooza from March to April. A new ticks item was released every day, and each item cost less than the oncoming. If players were still left with a few ticks, they were able to convert it into Robux with a defined exchange rate depending on the game's economy. But why did the platform do so? A minute. All right, I'm going to do Fly Me, Fly Original. Let's both go up inside of the air. Dude, we're... Simplicity. Roblox is a tight aim towards a certain demographic, and that are children and teenagers of a certain age. And with a platform that is mostly played on by kids, it could get quite confusing and convoluted for them. With features like ticks and Robux, players could have found it challenging and complicated to manage both, especially as the game expands and grows. So they removed ticks as a step towards simplifying things on the platform. The catalog was divided into sections whereby players could buy some items and ticks, and others with Robux in it, no doubt, seems like rather challenging for the key demographic. I guess I'm gonna call him if he gives like a good reason. All right, Zeph, what are you doing? Fake accounts. Now, because Roblox is awarding players currency, i.e. ticks, each time they log in, the surge in numbers of fake and bot accounts increased because users were only focused on increasing their bank balance and not actually playing on the platform. In a scenario like this, players would create several alternate accounts where they would just log in every day and earn their daily share of ticks. Some players even went ahead to make 100 different accounts. Doing this gave them 100 times the amount of ticks and they could then use it to buy items. It was practically ruining the economy for Roblox and the real essence of the platform. Hence, the only way to get rid of such players was to totally get rid of ticks. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to convince them that ticks are back. And I think it just worked. Not profitable. Ticks was basically free money for the players to continue with the game. Although Roblox denies this, everyone pretty much knows it's true that the developers and platform weren't able to reach desirable money targets with ticks in place. This is because players only collected ticks and focused on purchasing items with it and not Robux. Buying Robux is actually a rather expensive deal, and so as children at his Roblox key demographic, they would pay attention to collecting free ticks and buying items with it instead of asking for money from their parents. Of course, this was causing losses to Roblox and the developers because a good percentage of users were not at all interested in buying Robux from real money. And now that ticks has been removed, the sole mode of purchase is Robux, those players must buy it. It has been reported that the platform has actually been making more money than before now because of this decision. Players must not jeopardize their progress in the game and use Robux to grow. So they definitely cannot make silly moves and hence legally purchase Robux from Roblox. You're like, look at the guy jump! I know! He has the super- Trade currency glitch. Not many people know of this glitch, but it was also one of the major reasons that contributed towards the removal of ticks. If the players perform the trade currency glitch right, they could earn more ticks than they originally got. And of course, the tick players profited with what could be turned into Robux, meaning free money for users. On the trade currency page, the spread part had to be below zero for the glitch to happen. If it wasn't, players just refreshed until it was below zero. Once this happens, the players would convert all their ticks into Robux, and immediately after that, they converted the Robux back into ticks, and if done timely, players profited a few ticks. Although Roblox's decision was to remove ticks from the platform was off-putting for a lot of players, it was only after a while that they released the real reason behind it and understood the position they were in. Players always find ways to get around not spending money for everything, and they would have continued to profit from it had Roblox not removed ticks. It was an understandable position for Roblox given they made little money than they should have because players were profiting off of ticks. Alright, you're doing good. Dude, Don't I'm mess up now, Jen. I'm doing really, really good. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.